Okay, Gabriel, go talk to him. Huh? What do you want? I guess I shouldn't be surprised. I'm sure Evan King is pretty pissed right about now. I bet he has the entire town out looking for me. He's worse than my parents. You think I don't know that? You think I don't know what I did? Then you must think I'm some kind of a monster. There's something inside me, something completely messed up. I'm a mutant, a fucking freak. The only person I was ever able to talk to was my sister Lucy, and she's gone. No one gives a shit about me except Vance and the family. Can't you understand that? She... she really misses being home, and she's asked about me and here a lot. I think I had it all wrong. I shouldn't have come here. I bet Lucy is feeling just as bad as me. Please, tell Vance I've made my decision. I'm going home to Arfu. I hope to see you there as well. I'm just gonna gather my stuff together and say my goodbyes, then I'll head on back. Good job you agreed to deliver that letter for Lucy West. Now all you need to do is to, uh... Take care of the Arfu problem. I trust your talk with young Ian went well. I am quite interested in learning the results of your discussion. Did he come to a decision? As long as you maintain this level of civility, please proceed. Many years ago, I survived by drinking from fresh blood packs I recovered from hospital ruins. The problem with your idea is that these blood packs are scarce. What do you propose? Agreed. Please, take this proposal to Arafu. Speak with them, and then return to me with their decision. I thank you for showing me that your kind can be trusted after all. It is a lesson I will not forget. Now, what of young Ian? Tell me his decision. It saddens me to lose one of my flock, but I believe everyone has to follow their own path. All I was attempting to do was guide him. Now it seems that responsibility has fallen upon you. I hope you will be more successful. Please, I want you to take this. Consider it as an apology to you for all the hardships you had to endure finding this place. Goodbye, human. Our time together has been rather educational. Ah, good. A burning thought schematic. Now all we need to do is to find some way to put it together. <laughs> Hammer Mercs. Let's head to Airfu. Got a dispute to uh, settle in a non violent way. Are those ruins? Let's see if we can scavenge there. Might find some useful.
Oh look, a protectron! It likes a metal crash! <laughs> Ah, good. Ammo for the laser pistol. And some more scrap metal. Uh, just a lot of trash here. A beverage. Ooh. Tumblers today. Yeah. Might need a few pointers in how to pick locks. As there'll be some which are more difficult out there. Oh, guess some weren't as fortunate as uh, the Gomez family. Oh, good. Laser pistol parts, bottle caps, and booze. Oh, and according to that letter, America annexed Canada in this world. <laughs> For the, the US, at least the US of this world, uh, learned a few lessons uh, from them. A police baton. Uh, this place. Oh wait, we haven't searched uh, this bit of the ruins yet. Ah, a couple of bobby pins, booze, bottle caps, ammo, and 10 millimeter pistol parts. Oh, good haul. Now let's head to Airfo. Got a dispute to settle. I tell. There he is! The hero of the day! I know. I talked to Ian, and he told me everything you did. I don't know how you did it, but goddamn am I glad you walked up that ramp and lent us a hand. Thanks again, kid. Consider yourself welcome back here any time you're in this part of the wastes. Interesting. It seems they wish to enter into some kind of agreement. I guess it's better than pointing my gun down that ramp all day and hiding inside at night. Let Vance know he's got a deal. We'll do it. I'll speak to the others. I'm sure they'll agree with me. I've been saving up stuff for emergencies, in case things with Arafu got tremendously bad. You're welcome to some of it if you like. Come on back soon. I may have some stuff for you. Okay, let's uh, head back to Vance and uh, tell him no response. Back to the scary vampire lair, have we? <laughs> Always a pleasure to receive you in Maresti. What brings you down here today? Excellent. I knew you would serve as an ambassador for us in good faith. I will dispatch Alan to Arafu immediately to help serve as their guardian and honor my end of the agreement. Your efforts surpass those of the average human. In fact, I feel almost like you are a member of our flock. If you ever wish to learn our ways, you have but to ask. 
I'm certain our paths will cross again. Uh, Gabriel, uh, why did you buy those blood packs? Oh, allow the most powerful yeah. nation. Now you remember. Time to make a huge blood donation. Always a pleasure to receive you in Maresti. What brings you down here today? I can only offer my thanks. My people are getting accustomed to using these as a substitute for live prey. As compensation for your effort, allow me to at least give you something in return. That genetically challenged trader Carl doesn't know what he's selling. <laughs> See if we, you can avoid them the uh, same way you did last time. This way. Oh. Oh, you must save Gabriel! Here, have some shotgun shells! <laughs> ah, good. Shotgun and laser pistol parts, ammo, bottle caps, and some food. That's what I can sense, Holland. Let's head back to Megason. Now, before you go anywhere else, Gabriel, I'd go to sleep for a few hours. You look like you could use some.